Hey guys, Mr. K here with another part of my Let's Play series with Setzer. Um, I apologize for not doing this sooner. There was a couple of uh, videos that were pre-recorded and then the last one I just forgot. But I meant to show my uh, player ID for the longest time now. So here it is, 362-289-518. So if you want to you know, request or add me uh, and help me out, that would be great. Um, yeah, that's my number. So I thought that for this video, I would just go ahead and do something kind of random. I'm going to go into the uh, far plane, which I guess I can't go in from here. I probably need to go through some town. And uh, just take out some of the bosses there. Because it costs no energy. And I think it should be doable with enough luck. And if I fail, it doesn't really matter because I can just try again. The only downside, of course, is that um, none of these prizes are really going to help my setzers, but I still want to get it done. So, okay. <clears throat> I still remember way back in the day in the beta before the game came out in global. This was actually kind of a tough boss for a lot of people, but now it's probably a joke. Then again, all I have is dice, so I don't know. I could end up doing one damage each person. <laughs> Let's do it one at a time just for fun. Okay, that was the second best number I can get. Oh, there we go. RNG on my side this time. So yeah, pure skills. <laughs> I feel like Memu is a little bit louder than Nox. Okay, so anyway, I got Murasami. Pretty cool. Uh, can I go right back in? Yes. Okay, I forgot which one this is. Is it Chimera? Demon Chimera? Come on. <clears throat> yeah, so I remember he has some elemental resistances, but of course that doesn't matter because I am just using dice and my weapons, I believe, are all non-elemental. So again, just for fun, I'll do one at a time. Again, 5,000. Okay, no luck this time. Ouch. Getting worse. Okay, there we go. First good hit. Alright, so first round that I ended up doing about half damage. Um, I'll just repeat. <laughs> you guys already know. I don't want to have to like select it all again. Alright, so let's see what happens. Yep, there we go. I think um, other than this one who has an enhancer, everyone else is just wearing a boomerang. Of course it doesn't really matter that much when you're doing fixed damage. Force armor, okay, another armor that I cannot equip because it's heavy armor unfortunately. Alright, uh, is this Brachiosaur? <clears throat> I don't even remember what the prize one, prize for this one is actually. Um, oops. Hope he doesn't blow me away. Dice. Again, I can't wait to get double dice because it's going to basically, essentially double my chances of getting good damage output. But on top of raising five at a time, which is already tough enough, I'm also running into like awaken, awakening materials issues. Um, lots of sacred crystals that I'm short on and things like that. So the King Mog doesn't sell them right now, so it's kind of a problem. 
Anyway, it's a one at a time. This guy is always doing 5k, huh? Another 5k. What the? Wow, that was weird. Four in a row. This fight actually might take a few um, attempts. Oh, no five digit numbers coming out. This is not good. Ouch. Alright, you got me this time. But that was some bad RNG, I have to say. Essentially, if you aren't getting that five digit number, then it's like, doesn't really matter. They're kind of all the same to me. Okay, so. At least one of you guys got to get that 77k per turn. But it looks like I have two turns, basically, because uh, after that he will... <clears throat> after that he will summon uh, Meteor and kill me, so... Nope. Yes, okay. Alright, so one of those takes out about a third, so I need three 77ks. Um, maybe a little bit more than three. Okay, that was a very good first- oh no! I was about to say that's a very good first turn, but now I have only two sensors to work with. Oh, okay. Um, I'm trying to remember, I think sleep is one of those status ailments that if you cure it, they will be able to act on this turn, so it would be worth wasting a turn here. Yes. Alright, 77k? Nope. Oh my gosh. Alright, I need like a 5k at least. No! Oh good, no meteor. Okay, you're definitely dead this time. Alright, I got it. Unless I get all ones. Yep. Actually, I wouldn't have gotten it if... <laughs> it was up to these two. Alright, so I got that. I don't know what the prize is. What is the prize? I'm totally blanking on what it is. Killer bow. Ah. I don't think I can use that. You can use daggers, swords, and throwing weapons, right? Yeah, so. Yep. All right, so I got those three. I think there's no more in there. Yep. That was kind of fun, actually. Now, what else can I do? Oh, um, this is really random, but on my main account, I got to that Mysidia Nation or whatever. Definitely don't skip the story. Sometimes they have really funny lines and um, scenes, and there was a really funny scene where Lid... Well, I won't spoil it for you, but Lid and Jake are pretty hilarious, so yeah, don't skip that one. But I think I'm pretty much done with this video. I don't have a ton of um, energy left. I'm basically up to here at this point because I'm trying to get to get Golem. I guess I'll do one stage. No magic, use a limit first. Okay, that's easy. So no magic and use a limit burst essentially means to me just auto your way through it. Because assuming there's more than um, a couple rounds, there should be enough rounds for me to get limit gauge. Yeah, another issue I'm running into is that um, I was doing a lot of the maze, and then my inventory is constantly filling up. So yeah, I've been trying to build it out pretty evenly now because one of my sensors is maxed out at 4 stars, I can't awaken him, so I pretty much have no choice but to go ahead and enhance the other ones with the cactuars that I'm getting. 
But we are getting Cactuar Dunes this weekend, so that's gonna be really good. I actually prefer the new and improved Cactuar Dunes over the maze now. Unless you want um, materials, I guess, but as far as just pure leveling, the Cactuar Dunes are definitely better. But I'll probably do some more maze because while it's still here, it's a decent way to get sacred crystals and holy crystals and things like that, like the materials, so it's my best bet right now to kind of do everything all at once. But anyway, short video, just wanted to show you guys uh, those three bosses. It was pretty fun, especially that last fight, relying on RNG, but I uh, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.